Hey guys, uh, Mr. B here again, bringing you another awesome math video. This one on the midpoint formula. So you might be doing a unit on geometry or something like that now. Co co uh, let me say that again. Coordinate geometry. Sorry about that. And uh, one of the first formulas you probably learn in that is the midpoint formula. So the midpoint formula looks something like this, or at least the form that I give my students. So I usually say midpoint, and that's equal to x1 plus x2 divided by 2, and y1 plus y2 all divided by 2. So the midpoint formula, uh, basically all it does is calculate the distance, um, or sorry, the midpoint formula, all it does is calculate the exact middle point between two, two other points. So if you say have, um, you know, for example, a point, say, 2, 4, and then another point, um, 6, uh, 8. And uh, we want to calculate exactly in the middle between those two points. Then we use the midpoint formula. So all we do, call this x1, y1, x2, y2. All we do is we add up the... Um, X, x's, so 2 plus 6, and then divide them by 2, and then 4 plus 8, and then divide it by 2. So we have 6 plus 2 is 8, divided by 2 is 4, 4 plus 8 is 12, divided by 2 is 6. So the point that's exactly between these two points is 4, 6. So let me try another one, throw in a couple of negatives. So let's find the midpoint between negative 4 and negative 5 and 10 and um, negative 3 so let's see so the midpoint I'll have negative 4 plus 10 so that's my two x's divided by 2 and then I have my two y's negative 5 plus negative 3 divided by 2. So negative 4 plus 10 is 6. 6 divided by 2 is 3. Negative 5 plus negative 3 is negative 8 divided by 2. is negative 4. So 3 negative 4 is exact between these two points. So guys, I hope this helps. A little short video on midpoint formula. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in class.